Hey everybody, mm -hmm. it's a different day and I pretty much just got back from grocery shopping. Now, since Japan and since all of that, um, I haven't really been eating the best and I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it in the way that I feel during the day. Look at that wine. There's wine right there, right there. <laughs> I am feeling it even the way I feel during the day. I'm feeling a lot more sluggish. Uh, I've gained a kilogram since coming back from Japan, which is not really a stress for me, really. A kilogram is really no biggie. However, um, um, we're towards the end of November now, and I want to eat healthy from now until, say, mid to late December because for the 31st and whatever i'm going to be away and all of that so i just wanted to eat clean from now till about mid-december so a proper good three weeks i just want to eat proper and clean and go to the gym and get back at my stuff so i wanted to show you i just came back from woods i just wanted to show you what i picked up at least for the next two weeks the one thing that's gonna go quickly is definitely the fruits but Everything else will pretty much last me at least a week and then some. So I wanted to show you what I have, what I picked up. Um, uh, starting, uh, it's, it's a lot of food. <laughs> it's a lot of food. Starting from up here, we've got some fruits here. We've got strawberries, grapes, nectarines, a lot of baby spinach because you guys know I use baby spinach instead of lettuce. And uh, one of the reasons why I bought a lot of the baby spinach, this is baby spinach and this, uh, is because this salad here, it's a green salad but it doesn't come with lettuce i really I, I like that because i really don't like lettuce so i picked up two of those which i'm going to add the baby spinach to does it make sense okay um uh, popcorn because i've noticed that i was eating crisps lately and i was just like uh no let's get a healthier alternative so i picked up some popcorn seeded rolls i always pick up um these are snack bars which are pretty much for work this is pecan cashew and blueberry one also picked up some nuts as well uh, these are broad bean and cashew and the ones they have edamame and this is a stir fry i'm thinking of cooking a stir fry either not today probably tomorrow um so i picked up a stir fry pack with uh some sauces there the stir fry sauce i actually have i should have just picked up the fresh thai sauce but anyway uh got some pears here multi-seed rye bread i only picked up the i think there's about six slices in there i'm trying to stay away from buying bread altogether um got another salad for tonight tonight i'm going to be having chicken rotisserie chicken which is over there um then for the oh i literally just stuck my finger in this look at this okay i'll put it i'll put on i'll replace the bag um then i've got some vegetable here it's got got some uh farmer's vegetable selection which has baby baby broccoli which i love a lot i picked up two of those um here i've got some berries as you can see a jewel of berries um avocados i love i'm a big fan of watermelons melons big fan of both of these um what's this a wrap a multi-seed wrap for wraps sometime during the week with some mince meat and then you just put it in there eh, wrap and then uh yogurt this is my favorite yogurt from Woolworths. um butter because i'm out of butter and the rest is pretty much the green juices the cold press one you guys know i've talked about this one a lot this one i just picked up today this is coconut water with lemongrass cucumber and lemongrass which i actually want to try out now so i picked up a smaller version of that and a smaller version of this so that I can pick them up whenever I need, you know, if I'm going out. And then, of course, water. Standard. I love to just pick up 12s of water. These are the 750 mils. And normally, I grab one of these before I leave the house. And then right next to it is a bottle of wine for whenever. I just wanted to show you my snack drawer. Uh, my snack drawer is pretty much filled with peanuts. 
it's got peanuts it's got raw almonds which i sometimes blend up if i want them to. I, I i normally don't really like to eat them like this i like to blend them up if not i'll have them as flakes got peanuts normal peanuts peanuts got cashews in the back there these are the ones that i carry to work and this is the snack bar selection recently picked up this uh, beauty food from future life was quite impressed with it i ate this is the chocolate brownie one i ate the vanilla one at work um, I've got some raisins here, lots of raisins because since the picnic time we did a lot of, we did a huge salad with raisins in it. Um, and yeah, at the back there are all the seeds. So you got the uh, sesame seeds, lots of sesame seeds, chia seeds, lots of chia seeds. And then this is a mix of seeds. This is Miracles Plus Plus, which is a mix of different types of seeds. And that's pretty much what I would call my snack drawer. I don't have chips and chocolates and all of that and all these others are just miscellaneous drawers. my lunch very very basic just a little bit of a salad there and with no dressing and some chicken and a little roll and we're good forgot to add one of my favorite ingredients to the dish the acha I love acha Ugh, I love acha but I try not to have it too often because it kind of gets uh, a little bit hectic on your the smell from your pits, okay? From your armpits. If you have it every day, it's a little bit of a problem. <clears throat> Pepper. And a little bit of salt. There you go. Just for flavor. Flavor girl, you not doing this? You done cleaned up, honey. Okay, and that's me. That's me. That's my lunch. I try to avoid eating the skin, but you can't buy it without the skin from Woolies. And yeah, so. Mm hmm. Okay. Ciao. actually visible how sleepy I really am good morning everybody it is officially the next day um, it is Sunday this morning and normally my normal Sunday routine is to wake up for myself at last a cup of tea drink my apple cider vinegar uh, water my plants that is one of the days in the week where I water my plants all my plants uh, I've done that already I've got a, a bit of laundry going at the moment um, the lady who is like amazing lady who helps me out here at home couldn't come this week uh because of some personal issues so i had to you know 
get back to my roots and get back to what my mama taught me and do my own cleaning and my laundry and that's fine right now i've got towels going because you know i'm at the gym so i spend a, I, I use a lot of towels throughout each week um yeah so today is going to be pretty much a chilled day i need to go get a haircut but i'll go next week well this coming week uh today is pretty much a chill day i am going out for lunch with the family so i actually might vlog that that might be nice uh, going out for lunch with the family so i'm pretty much chilling until around 10 o'clock because i have to be gone around 12. so yeah pretty much chilling might vlog that might not i don't know we'll we'll see how it goes we'll see how it goes actually right now say in the next it is I think it's half past eight yeah it's 20 to 9 so in the next hour or so i'll make breakfast um uh, over the weekend i have early breakfast as opposed to when i'm at work i am still intermittent fasting but not as rigorously anymore uh before i used to eat after 12 but now i eat after 11. uh sometimes i even eat at half past 10 doesn't matter but i just try to uh keep it at 11 during the week and then obviously over the weekends i eat much earlier dinner the night before if i'm home so i typically will start eating breakfast around half past nine ten over the weekends still not bad it doesn't change or break anything i got these exceptionally beautiful cups from uh at home and i got them in different colors i got six of them and they come in pink and then they come in blue as well because I'm always buying stuff from at home. So yeah, not only did I buy that, I bought another, another couple of, I can't talk, more things from at home as well. But cheers. Good morning and I'll catch in. I'll jump in a little bit soon. So I have a little corner here which I want to make like a reading corner. And it's got a little bit of a picture there. I'm sorry from the glare of the window. My plant is outside because I'm watering her and she needs some sun. Um, so I literally did nothing to it. I put this blanket down and I thought, nah. As I keep looking at it when I'm recording, when I'm in here, I don't like how it looks. So we're going to change it up today. Today is the day. We're going to change it up. Mm hmm So for now, this is pretty much all I've done. I'm thinking of getting, what do you call them, fairy lights to just drape down here, like those fountain lights and the ones that work with like um, batteries because there isn't a plug, you know, a wall plug right there. So I can pick those up from Typo, I'm pretty much sure. This is a space where pretty much most of my friends or when they come in, if I'm recording or whatever, they sit here or I'll even sit here sometimes when I'm thinking about new content because it's right next to the window and I can sort of look out when I'm um, sitting here or when I do just a little motivational um, meditation session or whatever or if I'm reading through my motivational quotes or reading through my Bible or something, I'll just grab this corner. The reason why it's at the end of this cupboard here is because I hardly ever use that cupboard. It's got... I only change it out when I'm changing seasons. It's got like winter clothes in there right now and shoes that I barely wear. So I know that this is a nice space where everybody can like sit. to record in my bedroom. However, on Instagram, I had some prints on the floor. They were not put up yet, but these are the prints because I know they've... But they, I got some messages from people wanting to see them. These are the prints. It's very dainty simplistic art which i like and they're white and that one in the center has a black rim which i like the reason why that one has a black rim let me zoom in so you can see it the reason why that one has a black borderline is because it matches with this one so i love them i need a little something let me zoom you out a little bit i need a little something for here and i'm thinking a little tiny chair 
and a plant. Please be careful. We've got some fruits here, some melon and watermelon because, uh, honey, why not? Um, so first things first, green, green juice, not a green smoothie, green juice because um, a girl needs a little bit of green in her life, okay? Just a little bit of that. And then I started digging into these <laughs> yesterday. Let's start with the yogurt, actually. So my favorite yogurt is the Woolies one, the full cream one. The full cream one is great as long as it's full cream and it's not double cream. So I normally go in with about four or five, three, eh, sometimes four. Four or five, um, what's this, scoops of yogurt. And yes, I put that in my mouth. <laughs> and then I go in with some watermelon, which I love. Make just two of those. And come back out with some melon melon. So this is breakfast on my little cute little makeshift tray. This is one of the boxes that I used at the picnic, but th this is the lid. So we've got some green juice and um, yogurt with some me melon, watermelon, berries and yeah blueberries and raspberries and some green tea that is pretty much what i'm gonna have i need to get ready now because times are wasting and i need to get going and getting ready for lunch today so yeah that's pretty much it so i hope you guys enjoyed this video that's it that's chilling at home with me doing some work doing some housework doing some blah 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 and trying to get back into healthy eating um i hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you in the next one bye